it's that Brad Diamond and today we are going to be doing another type of YouTube video on this channel we are going to be doing a witchy haul a baby witch haul so yeah as you see I've got my cards ready to show you all the crystals I have but yeah I am pagan if y'all didn't know which I don't really talk about it much on this channel because this channel is usually a beauty YouTube channel but today I thought I'd show you everything in my witchy caboodle, which I do have a caboodle, but I've taken everything out of my caboodle and spread it out on my bed, and my cat is currently sitting on my incense. So, you know, that's fun. But, yeah, so excited to do this video with y'all. And a lot of the stuff I did get from Walmart, you can get it from, really cheap from Walmart, and some of the stuff I got on Amazon, and some of the stuff I got from local businesses. So I will be linking in the description where I got everything, the prices, and if you want to shop, click in the link down below, babies. So yeah, let's get started. So the first thing I have are some crystals from a set I got from Amazon, and it comes with a Know Your Stones, and it has all of the stones front and back, what they are and what they do and what they're used for and I really really like this for any of my baby witches who are kind of new into this and don't really know what the crystals are used for me <laughs> and you know just want to learn more about what they're used for what you can use them for and yeah and then they have pictures of them and what they are like what you can identify them as like what they look like so first we have the chakra stones so we have red jasper for your root chakra. Then we have citrine for your sacral chakra. I'm pretty sure I reading's hard, you guys. And then we have Amazonianite for your if I can find it. Amazonianite for your heart chakra. And this looked pretty different from the picture, so I'm just it actually looks pretty the same on camera, but in real life, it's a little bit faded. But it is still pretty gorgeous. It's great. And with Amazon, you got to... And there was, a there was a certificate of authenticity that came with it. So you always want to make sure you have a certificate of authenticity when you get your crystals. Or wherever you get... You know, wherever... Hey, kitty. He just made an appearance. Yes. Hey, baby. But, yeah. And then we have our lapis lazuli, which is our throat chakra. And I am so sorry if I am saying these wrong. Feel free to correct me in the comments down below. This is our throat chakra. And then we have our amethyst, which is our third eye chakra. So, yes. And then we have our clear quartz, which is our crown chakra. Next, for our gemstones we have our howlite and this actually kind of looks like marble well it reminds me of marble and it's so pretty and just so aesthetically pleasing rose quartz and then i'm not actually sure i've probably never heard of this crystal actually it's called appetite it looks like appetite and it's a gorgeous blue color and now my cat's trying to eat the crystals. Then we have fluorite, which is a really pretty green color. And we have obstinite, obstin, obstidane. I don't, again, I don't know how to say these names. Um, you get what I'm saying if you're, again, um, baby witch or witch pagan. It's a beautiful black color. And then we have red adventuring. which is almost like a molten lava color. And then we have, oh, I missed a, I missed a chakra. I'm, I knew I was missing a chakra somewhere. I didn't even see it. The tiger's eye, the solar plexus chakra, the tiger eye. Oh, I knew I was missing one. I was like, why is there one there? The tiger eye. And then we have pyrite, which has helped to help reduce anxiety, infectious diseases, and then I have this other, um, I have this other amethyst, um, cluster, which I've had since I was about seven. It came from Australia in a little passports thing. 
the little passports box if you don't know what that is that's just a subscription box you can get where you learn about different countries when you're little and it was actually my sister's and she gave it to me so i've had this since i was really really little and i've kept it <laughs> so yeah and then this rock is actually just a rock my little cousin gave me and it just looks really cool i don't know what crystal it is but it's just it just gives me really good energy so i kept it and my little cousin loves rocks loves crystals um so she gave it to me and she's 11 years old and she's the sweetest little girl so i just kept it i really, really like it it's my favorite <laughs> So next I have from the crystal shop in downtown Frankfort, Kentucky, which is where I currently live. I have black tourmaline, which is a huge chunk of black tourmaline. And it was like $6, super cheap, and I love it. And all of these, and you really don't have to worry about if these are authentic. Like, they authentically sell all these crystals. They have crystal pillars. They have, like, tumbled crystals. They have raw crystals. They have herbs, um, sage, tarot cards, oracle cards. They have, they have it all, like, if you're into witchcraft, they have it all. And next I have two other pieces of pyrite. They were both $2. I mean, just love that crystal shop downtown. The best. I mean, they make you feel so at home. You don't ever have to feel worried about, you know, asking any questions. They are currently out of Moldavite, but they do restock every month, and they will be getting more. So, um, if you're going and looking for Moldavite, they're currently out. Sorry. So, next I have some shells. Um, I actually just got these at the beach. It used to have, like, my name on it, but I just took it off. Um, have some shells. I don't know. I just felt like a witchy vibe from, like, these shells. I was just like, ooh, shells, you know? Because, like, I just really like these shells. I just thought it would be really cool to have them um, in my little witchy caboodle. So, yeah, I just have these shells, and I love, like, the little cork bottle. It's just, it gives me a really, like, medieval vibe, you know? Next is my pendulum. I feel like I've already shown you my pendulum on this video. I don't know. I've had to, like, record this and redo this so many times. Okay. I'm just going to show it to you again anyway if I have. I have a rose quartz pendulum. And it came with this set. It came with the set of crystals. Yes. And I love rose quartz. It, rose quartz is meant for love and healing. So yes. And then I went downtown. I went to downtown Frankfurt and got a candle holder, a ritual candle holder. And it has like the sun with the little face on it. And it is so cute. It was like $2.85. And I swear they were so cute. There was a little black one with like pentagram. And then there was just some plain ones. And I got this one because I really wanted the black one with the pentagram. But like I knew if my grandma saw it, she would freak out. So I just got that one. So next are obviously tarot cards. Oh my gosh. I got these at um, Half, Half Price Books in Lexington. They are the medieval deck. I also have like the little book explaining what all the cards mean. These are the medieval deck. So they are, they look like this. So they do. And um, they're from the Elizabethan slash Shakespearean, obviously medieval era. Oh, that's the Renaissance. That is the Renaissance. That's the Renaissance. What am I talking about? Don't listen to me. Come on. But like, yeah, so they are the medieval deck and obviously tarot cards, you can get any type of tarot cards. They have tarot cards pretty much anywhere you can look. I did get those in a bookstore. So next is candles. I got these off Etsy. I got a ton of candles. I got them in every color. So pink, red, orange, yellow, green, yellow, green, green, blue, purple white black and then i got a silver and a gold one and it actually came with a scroll came with a little scroll and it says what each candle can be used for in rituals and i actually really liked that and i will be purchasing these again when i use them all up like 
they're really cool. I use the gold one for my altar, for my altar to my goddess. And I really, really like these so much. I really like them. So next on my little witchy haul is my sage. I got this downtown Frankfurt um, at the crystal shop. It was 10 bucks. The sage it is lavender sage. It is, I think, eucalyptus and lavender sage. And I've used it about three times, and it still is, like... I'm not going to take it out of the thing, because I don't want to, like, have, like, sage everywhere in my bed. But it smells so good. You can literally smell it through the plastic, through your mask when you're down there. I mean, it, it has a strong smell, you guys. It has a really strong smell. Yeah. I mean, and it, it will last you a long time. Like, and... You can also get smaller things of it. There's like a ton of stuff in that crystal shop. I cannot stop talking about that crystal shop. Like it is so immaculate. So next is my incense. I have three things of incense. I have just the regular incense that doesn't really smell like anything, which I have not opened yet. I have lavender incense. I haven't really opened yet. And then I have strawberry incense, which I'm currently using right now. As you can see, it's open. These smell so good, you guys. They smell amazing. And I actually got these for like 87 cents each at Walmart. And you can actually get um, incense, incense holders at Walmart. And they're just as good as like the $10 ones at any type of um, crystal shop. I don't even like, even as much as I love the crystal shop downtown, I don't buy their incense because I know I can get these at Walmart. And you can't really buy like crystals at Walmart, you know? <laughs> you get that? You get it? All right. So next is something very personal to me, and it is my little mini altar. I use that gold candle, so this is my altar. So my pagan goddess is Minerva, so the um, the goddess, the Roman goddess of um, war and wisdom and kind of like, cra not crafts, I'm trying to think of the word, like man-made things, like you know what I'm saying? So, um, like, handiwork is what I'm trying to say. I, I just drew a blank right there. Handiwork. So, in my little altar kit, I have, because of the war thing, I have this Suicide Squad bracelet. And it has, like, a lot of weapons on it. And then I have, and her colors are gold. So, I have a lot of gold rings that I can't fit, a lot of gold rings, a gold belly button ring, oh. and then some gold, some gold coins, and I have this homemade, um, this little container that, um, a family friend made for us, oh my god, take a shot every time I flip my hair, no, drink responsibly, guys, again, drink responsibly, <laughs> But yeah, this is like something I take with me everywhere if I want to like set up a small altar. Just everywhere I go. But yeah, that is pretty much everything I have in my witchy caboodle. Ex oh, one more thing. I keep forgetting. I always forget. Dried, dried roses. I have dried roses and they came in the set with the Amazon. With the Amazon that came from Amazon. And I will link everything down below. Yes. Okay. Now that's everything. I'm sorry that this video is so chaotic. I have had so much coffee today. And a monster. Pipeline punch. But, um, yeah. I will definitely be seeing you guys later. Can't wait. Bye-bye.